What's happening, beautiful gamers? Blank here and welcome to yet another Metroidvania for the channel with Moonlight Pulse. This one is one that we covered the demo a while ago, and it was one of those that it was like, yeah, this is gonna be interesting, this is gonna be good, we gotta give it a shot whenever it comes out. Now the full release is finally here, we're finally ready to play it and we're finally ready to see what's gonna happen. Now, this game describes as teamwork matters most in this seamless, fantastical metroidvania with a living, breathing world. Realize each character's true potential to take down an invading force of overwhelmingly powerful parasites. So it seems like we're gonna be... I described it before Cells at Work. I don't know if you ever watched that anime. Um, pretty much Cells at Work meets Metroidvania or meets video games. There was also, I don't know if you guys remember, there was a cartoon that was also like having to do with pills and things like that to like combat parasites and combat bacteria. It was an interesting concept and recently we played Biogon, which was something similar but with a dog. So anyways, I'm super hyped about this. It looks pretty exciting. I want to say thank you so much to Seafloor Games for giving me a review copy of the game. want to point that out. If you guys like the video and you guys enjoy and feel like this is something this game is something that you guys might want to play might want to give it a shot i'm going to leave the link to the game in the description down below so you guys kind of like can check it out now as of the moment this video is releasing there is still a 20 percent early release discount for the game so you guys might want to snatch it for a good price if it is something that you guys want to play but anyways spoken of let's bring this to you guys and let's see how good is this game going to be? I'm excited. Let's go, guys. <laughs> all right, all right. This is the spot. The fiery parasite should be nearby. No sign of the monster, though. Maybe it burrowed back under the shell? Uh, time to go hunting. This should be fun. Silex, kind of like a badass character, if you guys ask me. Like, he's pretty cool. It's one of those characters, I don't know, it's like every single game, whenever you guys play it, each character has of course their personality and the way that they do things. And uh, this guy has that dive of like, you know, I'm Vegeta, pretty much. Nice, a safe spot. Uh, let's go down. Die! Now, this is one of those games where it kind of felt good whenever I played it for the first time, like the combat system the movement system, everything was kind of clean. So I'm really curious as to how the game is going to behave. Can I die? No, I don't die in water. How the game is going to behave now that the full release is here. Of course, lately we have been playing certain games that call themselves Metroidvanias and haven't been a Metroidvania. So let's see how good this game follows the formula. Since that we were getting into trouble. Now we finally got the dash. Ooh, air dash throughout the get-go. I gained some little speed boost whenever we like do it. Nice. Okay, I'm getting destroyed. Nope. Yeah, none of that was good. That's fine. Can I yes? I hadn't noticed that you can actually hit upwards. Silex health has increased. Nice, right off the get-go. We get a little bit of extra power to be able to combat whatever it is that we're going to encounter. Maybe a parasite right off the get-go? Mini boss? Nothing yet. Could go down. Oh, I could do something like... Oh, shite. Oh, shite. Okay, so it seems like we cannot make that jump just yet. Because over here it's simple, because you kind of like gain speed and that's kind of like what allows you to move faster. Oh, never mind. There you go. Is that good? Cool, cata cool Catalyst, an organic crystal formed with Auraska's body. The battle receives extra healing from the pellets dropped by enemies. Okay, so right away we're getting pretty... Oh, what is that? Hmm. Subcutaneous burns! The parasite's definitely down here somewhere. Some pretty serious structural damage too. This thing may be nastier than we thought. Good! It's been a while since I had a real chance to show off! 
map updated. We have a map. Oh, here it is. So we know where we have to go. Uh, it seems like we can do a nice zoom. No zoom out. This is where we gotta go. And everything has been cleansed so far. So yeah, we've been doing a pretty good job. Let's go. Oh, oh this is if we wanna jump higher. Fine. And then any... I am not sure if the game is gonna have like secret rooms or anything so i'm hitting every wall for a while i'm not gonna of course go crazy with it if i find them i find them if i don't find them i'm gonna find them the fuck is that oh i can do this right yeah. nice journal updated hey jump here buddy it seems like based on what i can see at the bottom we will get the opportunity to like swim under the viscosity or whatever is it after a while like oh, under the acid i think we're gonna be able to do that uh, there is death definitely cannot make that jump okay i remember this game starting pretty cool and then branching off into something a little bit different and of course dealing with these enemies that kind of like have that really nasty power which i don't really enjoy that much feel like i'm gonna die anytime not good help 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 help, help anybody you what's that oh chase it i remember that too it was kind of cool so if I remember correctly, this game on its demo showcased a lot. And... Oh no. Oh no! Ugh. I'm so dead. Don't die. And something tells me... That... This is going to be one of those games that... It's not going to be that long. Which, honestly speaking, sometimes is perfect. Because... We got so many metroidvanias that we gotta cover and that we gotta tackle and that we gotta like handle over here that I kinda like unique concepts. Oh my god, am I gonna die? That, of course, having a little bit shorter games is kinda like cool. But you never know, of course, because it could be a little bit shorter, but then it is like, oh yeah, it's a little bit shorter here, but then at the same time. Damn. For some of you guys, you guys might want to have something a little bit longer, of course. Uh, stay away from me. Let's go. Nice! We got it right on time. Alright, I could go down. Or, oh, so over there, there is like a parasite in there. I want that. Oh no, this is this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. Okay, so there is like a safe in here. There's a safe in there. I think we jumped down, so I don't know if we went through this room before. Yeah, this is like the beginning of the game and then we can do something like i don't know if we can but oh we can oh let, let's say we can actually do that that would be awesome if it's possible i am not sure but no nah. missing a little bit of extra propulsion i think i know where to get it it's gonna take a little bit of extra gameplay before doing that let's get down I think the boss fight is right here. Time to save our buddy. Yeah. Bitch. <clears throat> Dick! <laughs> oh wow, did you just- Oh, I, I remember this guy being nasty. Wait a second, no! Wait, what's happening? Okay, let's avoid it! Oh, he's flying! Wait, he has health! Oh, nice! Can actually go down! <laughs> There's no healing! Oh, no! Yeah! No! Hi, <laughs> bitches! Well, I think we first tried him the previous time, but I guess he was 
I was wrong. Let's go. <laughs> Bye, bitch. <laughs>Pleased to meet you, Silex. I am Laguna from Pygal's Code. Well, our farm from Pygal's Code, so why don't you stick with me for now? I'll get you to the surface in one piece. Follow me. Para para pam pam para para. This is one of the coolest parts of this game, right? It's like the fact that she doesn't have a dash though, but the fact that we get a new character is just so cool. The game ends if one of my characters' health reaches zero. Hey guys, I was over here, so why I cannot be here anymore? Laguna, come on! Yeah, but then you can take advantage of her to like attack characters from far. And this is gonna be the tricky part whenever we see the, the vessels, because that's when you actually gotta like go around. It's gonna take a little bit more work than normal. Now, remember exactly where is it that we need to go on things like that? It's gonna be a little bit complicated. <laughs> you guys see those little bugs whenever you hit them, like they kind of like break their their status and they're like chasing here and there, and it's like, but look at this! This little bitch can go down here, yes! But yep, that's what I was talking about. Now that we have different powers, we can actually take advantage of them. And utilize each one of the different powers that we have to our advantage. Do a little bit more. Be able to like progress better. Just, just do better in general. Hmm. Not like this. Nice. Nope, stay away from me. Once again, this is a cool game in which you're changing characters, you're doing different activities, having different ways to progress. I, I think it's something that is kind of cool. And you don't see that too often on, on like games where you're kind of like changing characters. It is an interesting concept. It is kind of hard to do, though. And I do understand why. I mean, how wouldn't it be hard, right? It's like you're trying to like make a game work with a balancing of different characters while at the same time being able to change between them and do this and do that. Yeah. Did you really try to get close to me just like that? Ooh, disgusting bastard. Let's go. You gotta go in there if I'm not mistaken, yeah. Then you can actually go up, but we're gonna be going around, go straight, uh, and of course it's gonna kick me out because there is a worm in there. I remember that. And this is the cool part. Like this is how we transverse through the world. Like we just gotta go through the I guess these are blood vessels. Is that a secret? It seems like one. Mm. 
<laughs> Shit! He's dead. Yep. Uh, to reach out that guy at the top, we're not gonna. Oh, wow! Oh, right. I was like, it's not gonna be easy, but then all I need to do is just see that in here and just kill it from there. And then, yep. And as you guys can see, the difficulty of this game is kind of like there. I'm getting my ass clapped and I don't see any way for me to heal just yet. I can, Ooh, we can see the map pretty fast. Nice. Excellent quality of life right here. Ooh, there was an area there that we didn't explore before, which is interesting. If you guys take a look at the map in the middle section, like we could have gone down, but we didn't. I wonder why. We'll eventually go back to that area so we can re-explore it. Okay, that's cool. I, ri I like that. I like that. So far, so good. Okay, let's get going. Silex, are you okay? I heard the whole fight from here. I am sorry. I completely underestimated that monster. <laughs> nah, don't worry about it, really. I, I gotta keep myself on my toes somehow. You are not invincible, Silex. You should have called for backup. Please. You know, we are stretched to two things already. Besides, turns out that I had backup. Hi! Well, hello there. You must be Laguna. Yeah, 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 that's me. Hmm, how do you know that? See these ears? I can hear almost everything that happens on or under the shell. When I want to at least, wait, uh, are we not like a turtle creature? It's pretty handy for locating parasites and other threats that, to the health of our home. I'm Director Christine. Welcome to Curative Agent Headquarters, Laguna. You guys are Curative. What? No way! My grandpa told me all about you. You have five parasites like Silex does. Well, some of us are a little less hands up, but yeah, we protect Aurask from threats, parasites included. Creatures like Aurask are so huge, it's easy to forget they're living beings with the same needs as you and I. But if our home suffers, so do we. So someone's got to track down the parasites that threaten its health. Anyway, <laughs> it says I take the back. <laughs> Thank you, Silex. Anyways, usually we'd assign an agent to escort you back home, but I'm afraid that's not possible right now. I'm happy to take him, Christine. I owe him one. Unfortunately, we need our hands on deck, boy. The current infestation is only getting worse. Maybe I can actually stick with yous for a bit. I can be helpful. Appreciate the thought, but I don't want you to get hurt, Laguna. This is dangerous work. Come on, Christine. This little guy practically saved my life. Laguna will create a massive, awesome, fantastic curative. Plus, he is the man's best friend, so why not? Silex, you make everything so difficult. Come on. You already admitted that, well, I mean, you're spread thin, and uh, I'll, make full, I'll take full responsibility for his safety. Uh, are you sure this is what you want, Laguna? Oh, yeah! Yeah! Alright, alright. Fine. You've got the spirit. At least, that counts for a lot here. But if you want to be a curative in training, you'll need to proper to need the proper tools for the job. Hold on! And... Oh, yeah. There. Now I have given you an Oras vitality meter. It measures the overall state of Oraska's health. Essentially, the higher the meter reads, the fewer parasites remain. You should be all set. Stick close to Silex, follow his instructions, and you'll be fine. Silex, you better not let this get away, get, get in the way of your work. I'm trusting you on this. I've got this. You know you don't have to worry about me. And you know I'll never stop worrying anyways. Now go! Seek out the remaining parasites and keep Oraska safe! Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's go. Got work to do. Now, some of the readings in this game I might not do it, depending on who are we talking with. Oh, right, we cannot go here. Because some of them might be like secondary, so it is gonna like a little bit unnecessary if you ask me. Hello there. Hey, old man! <laughs> guess who took down that gastroinferna giant parasite today? Yes, guess, guess! You know, let me! 
<laughs> what are the fireworks? I used to eat those for breakfast, boy. You are past your prime then. I know for a fact that you only eat cold oatmeal for breakfast nowadays. <laughs> Paul Wars for a fighter who's never even mastered a wall jump. I can wall jump. You've seen me do it. If you cannot do it consistently, you certainly haven't mastered it. Ah, you're right. As always. It's good to see you, Ogizer. Likewise. Though, I hope you're not slacking on your training without me to badger to, to you. Not at all. In fact, I recently perfected the flip dash. And flip dash, too. Anyways, we gotta speak with that chicken over there. I wonder if you can shoot downwards. Yes, you can. Let's go. Take advantage of all of those. Can I just shoot upwards? I cannot. And there's no way for me to reach the top just yet, I believe. Wait, can I? I think I can. I'll go I'll go back to you. But I'm gonna do something. Oh, dang it! You're gonna probably have to let like, go from there, sure. Who are you? Charlotte, officially a curative, huh? Congratulations, how does that feel? Well, she looks like Cult of the Lamb type of creature. Not particularly different. The title doesn't actually make me feel any better, you know? I still think that the director should assign someone more capable to protect Big Scout. We are really hurting up here, Silex. We're hurting anywhere. I've never seen the curative spread so thin. Christine's doing her best. I promise you that much, but sometimes, sometimes ain't that easy, man. Sometimes ain't that easy. Yeah, I bet she is. As long as it's not her village fighting to stay warm up here, you know that? Damn! Yeah, that's a little bit of a bold statement. Really bold. Oh, we have, do we have a journal? Ooh, we have items. Can I equip this? Wait, what, what is it that you do? Extra healing. Yes, please. And then, oh yeah, this is the journal where we can see everything. Strength, range, how many are we defeating? Big boy over here. Let's go. And then we have the options, of course. Oh, it says that I'm playing with a DualShock controller. Thank you very much for identifying that game. Adorable. <laughs> um, yeah, I think I can still go straight. Oh, yeah, yeah, we can, we can do that. Um, but that's not what we're looking to do. Let's speak with the chicken over here. Ah, Silex, thank goodness. I need to talk to you. Ah, what is it, we? It's just me or... Or, 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 you know, there, there've been more parasites attacks lately than usual. If, 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 if I tell you that you're right, it'll, oh, well, I mean, if I tell you that you're right, it'll, it will only stress you out more. So there has been more attacks than usual? Everything will be okay, I promise, I promise. I have dealt with serious infestations before. But, 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 what if it keeps getting worse? I have a terrible feeling about this Silex. Oh! Um, my purity crystal has gotten so closely. There's toxic energy in the air. Deep breath, knee. Deep breath. <laughs> I like it. Anyways, time to go. We know where we have to go. Right here. Up. We should be able to go up. Yep. And here we go. New place. If I, I am not mistaken, over here is not the path to go. I believe that this is like a place where we need to... Oh, wow, did I just run straight into it because I was on super speed? No, bitch. No, bitch. Okay, I gotta kill this guy. He's gonna throw his thing. What? Did you just attack me like that? Disgusting bastard. Oh, and I cannot really kill that thing. And we don't have any powers to come here. Okay, there's nothing that we can do in here. That's fine. Big boy. Shoot at me. Wow, those things have so much range. I didn't even notice that. So you're just gonna have to like hit him multiple times and then wait for the shot. Let's go. Nice. Now we can actually get moving. Oh, jeez. Ah! It's a good thing that we're not that bad at moving around. 
Okay, we gotta uh, move fast. Let's go. Okay, I think we can actually make a run for it. Ah, uh, no, we cannot reach it. Perfect moves over there. Give me that heal because we need those. Kill it before it starts moving too fast. And look at that. There's something at the top that we don't have the powers to do just yet. Um, Can we go on the top of this? Yes, we can. Ooh, secret. Yes, recovery rack. When the better takes damage, they recover some health. If they allow... Oh! So this is like you change characters and then okay that's that's something that i wanna uh, that i do want to equip so how do you equip it go over here and we give it to you that way we can actually have two different characters together you guys know the drill it's a little bit stronger i think if you see the map no it doesn't tell you that there was a secret in there. okay oh we cannot push this okay sure Ah, and I remember this area. Yeah, this over here is going to be... Okay, I remember it. Yeah, unfortunately, there's nothing that we can do here just yet. I believe we got to go down. Yeah. Don't kill this thing just yet. That's one of the things about this game. There is a lot of depth on like where do you have to go and why do you have to go there and like the areas that you have to visit. There's a lot of it. Like a lot, lot, lot. Take a look at the map. This one will send me straight up and then up. Uh, is that any good though? If I go straight, once again, I could go straight or I could go up. Up it's gonna kick me out, but I could go straight still. And I can go down here. Because this is what I'm looking for. Like, I'm looking for a solution to a problem that we have. What is that? Nice. Journal of Data. That's the one that I was talking about. That thing is dead, which means that if you guys take a look at the map now, that's cleansed and we can even move towards that bottom area, which is great. Bye, bitches. So now we can actually move through there, which we were not able to do before. There it is. And if you guys see it, I don't want to go out. I want to go straight. That game didn't give me many choices. Now, unfortunately, it seems like in this game, which is one of the things that it's a little bit sad, Purity Stone, this Faceless Crystal provides resistance to uh, poison. So let's just grab this and give it to the doggo. Right, so we can do this and then we can go down. It doesn't work. That's okay. Whatever. You know what? That's fine. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, okay, listen, listen, listen. At least we can actually get moving with this. Yeah, it, it takes a little bit, but you can actually manage to get it, which is great. Let's move a little bit faster. Over there, we cannot really go just yet. That's fine. And then... Nice job. As you guys can see, it's kind of cute how we have 54%. That means that most of the parasites are being cleansed, and that's actually great. Now, the only thing that I'm curious about, of course, is how much time did they have to, like, polish this game, push it through, and blah, blah, blah. Because you can see some of the... Not bugs, but little details here and there, like especially when you like try to do damage. Ah, oh, come on! Oh, what the? Ooh, this... Ah, come on, stop it! 
Oh, that was so nasty. Those things are so disgustingly nasty. Stupid. You see? Flying enemies. Nobody likes them. Leave me alone. Oh my god. Am I gonna have to like deal with that thing? It's fine. Touch it. Let's go. Ooh, healing. Nice. I was about to die. But now because of that healing, we are pretty much immortal. It's one. Two. Three. Touch that. Start shooting. Oh, the he took a lot of damage. Let's go. Okay, this is going to be a little bit nasty. So I'm guessing, yeah, something like that. And uh, oh yeah, I remember what's gonna happen here. That's cool. Here we go. Wait, 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 Silex! Ah, oh, you're always dashing away. Ah, uh, you're going to leave me behind. Laguna, I'm going to tell you something you may not like. When I was training my mentor, Victor, he never slowed down for me. Not in any way. And he kept and he kept up somehow. I do not think I'd be the curative that I am today if he hadn't pushed me like he did, kid. Ooh, boy, I'm out of breath. I cannot feel my feet. I just don't have your stamina. It's not always about stamina, but the bad news is you're never going to be as strong as I am. But you got talents that I do not have, and you're resourceful, creative. And you are a curative agent now, with a problem to solve life's... Wait, with a problem to solve. Lives might be at stake. So stop thinking about how Silex will solve the problem and show me how Laguna would do it. Ah, oh, wait a second. There is this thing that I did as a kid to get downhill faster. I do not know how well I can control it, but what if I... Wee, Wee. That is it, Laguna! There we go, boy! That's it! Incredible! I had no idea that I could move that fast. See what I mean? You've got what, I, what you need, kiddo. It just takes a little bit of creativity and confidence. And now you have the new power, which is uh, changing to Laguna, and then you can do this. And then, yeah, you have to do something like that. Like, yeah. It's, it's a little bit tricky, but it can be done. Give me that. Silex attacks has increased. Beautiful. It's, it's a little bit creative, like it does give you access to different powers and different abilities. And I think it's kind of cool the way that it works, which is pretty enjoyable. It took me a while to be able to discover how to use it at the beginning, if I gotta be honest though. Uh, this place. Right. Shines. Hello there and welcome to the Prime Thoracic Parasite Contaminate Facility. Name is Chivo! Unfortunately, for security reasons, this facility is closed to members of the general public. Please exit the premises at your earliest convenience. Chivo, I remember you, it's been a while. Oh, Silex, ah. Sorry, I didn't see it was you. Please explore the place as at your leisure, do whatever you want. Actually, wait a moment, there's this new promotion thing that I'm supposed to tell you guys about. If you get enough parasites, we will reward you with like cool and interesting stuff, apparently. According to this informative brochure, your journal logs each type of parasites that you fought. You feed enough parasites of a specific type to complete the journal entry, whatever that means. When then come back here and well, I'll give you a reward. Wait, isn't this a contaminated facility? Shouldn't we capture the parasites, not kill them? I am just reading the brochure. You could ask my supervisor about it, but she's not here today. So we get free stuff just for smashing parasites? Where's the downside? The downside is that I have to keep track of it all. <laughs> One second before we do anything. Let's see if we can actually do some jumping in here. Oh, yeah, right. We don't really want to go there. And if I take a look at the map, it connects through the top, which is fine. But then it's going to send you back. And then again, we want to go down. But then we have to explore the parasite facility too. Okay, we got things to do, guys. This place is awesome, actually. Look at that. Baby parasite. Look at that. My best friend, my body, my body. What? What are you looking at, blood bag? 
Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to be rude. I just didn't know parasites could talk. And I didn't know fluffy little guys like you could look so delicious. Come closer and we'll have a nice chat. I met people like you before. You want to be scary, but you are not really that scary. No, I am a vicious criminal and I will drain the blood from the heart of whatever creature I'm on. Whatever. Also, can you tell that stupid lizard to bring me my juice? Clutch is always late in this awful place. What, is, what if I had changed this guy? Hey there, buddy. It's been a while since I dragged your slimy catapax in here. Fight me, you coward. I'll drain the fluid from your body. I'll stalk out your eyes through your... Cut that tough tag. We both know you cannot harm me from inside the cell. Fine. Just know that I'm still thinking about drinking your delicious blood. Sure, whatever. I have a question for you. What's causing the recent surge of infestations? I'm not saying nothing to you. And you cannot make me boost off. Dick. And this is when the cool part begins. I think we can go inside of this. Yep. Oh. I haven't seen one of these worms. Well, I'd lo as long as you see them, something happens. Oh my god, this is the this is the section that it's gonna become bad. Shock loss, silex, electrical damage to his attacks. Absolutely yes. Now we have a tremor, which is disgusting. That's fine. Now this guy can jump, so we don't really need you. More damage should be cool. Empty. Strange. There's supposed to be something in this cell. Wait. Stop! Something's very wrong. Yep. You guys remember by there was supposed. Yep. Really weird, huh? Oh, hello there. There was a secret wall. Nope, there's nothing in here. All the creatures are gone, guys. That is bad news. Hello there, he's gone. Hey guy, yo. Ah, six letters, a third R, shell reptile, Shivo. Oh, Silex. Did anyone enter or exit the facility while we were gone? Nope, I don't think so. I didn't see anyone. Why? Every cell in the facility is empty. Every parasite we locked up is free. That sounds pretty bad, but I am just the receptionist. Isn't it your job to keep the parasites locked up? Really? You didn't see anything at all? Hear everything? Not a whisper, not a whiff. I really don't think that I can help you with this one. It's not my job description. But if you made any progress in your journal, I can take a look at that. Dick. Christy, if you can hear me, I've got a huge problem on our hands. Can I? Three parasite journals. As a reward, I'm authorized to give you whatever this thing is. Another blade which increases my damage. Nice! Uh, five more parasites. Two more to go, sure. Until then, I'll be waiting here. Nice. Okay, so I could go down, which is probably where I want to go. Let's go. I can see that there's like a secret in there. Dash through the vessels. Oh, we can go faster. Right. I saw a lot of secrets. If I open up the map, I want to go outside here first. Oh, this is a... Who are you? You were not here before. Hello, Silex. Welcome to Araska's Lungs. Would you like to learn about the fascinating role of the lungs? Not really. Chaffee, you've given me this speech three times before. I know how the lungs work. Maybe your little blue friend has some respect for science. Why don't you step aside so we can talk to him? You massive... Listen, take it easy. Anyways, right now we're in the lungs. I don't know if we're actually going to be encountering this place. is massive. There's a lot going on. I could reach this, but I cannot even go higher, so that's a problem. And we cannot do anything here. Good. That is fine. So we have a little bit of a progression map all the way to the bottom right corner, which is great. I'll take that. I want that. I don't care about that. I don't have a choice in here. Kill that thing from the bottom. This is like such a beautiful image. You should get some rest, bud. I'm surprised you're still awake. I haven't slept very well in a while. I'm afraid they get nightmares some nights. Most nights. You lost some, huh? Yep. And now whenever I sleep, it's like I'm falling forever. Like everything is gone wrong and there's nobody there to save me. 
I thought that being a curative, learning to fight back like you, I thought maybe it might make my dreams go away. I grew in a boat, I have nightmares like that too. Not as often as I once did, but they pretty scared me when they happen. But they're only dreams. You gotta take a deep breath and focus on what's real and in front of you. You're here, I'm here, we're safe. Yep, I'll try. Thanks Alex, I'm gonna try to get some sleep. Rescue count has increased by one. What is this rescue count thingy? I'm curious what those rescue count even means. Okay, so we could explore the top first, which is what we should do. That's a lot of damage and we cannot do anything here. Oh boy, Silex is gonna clap cheeks. Hey, little bitch. Oh, the crit. The crit right there was delicious. Okay, okay, okay. Nice job. Right, so if I got this, we're gonna be going down. But what if I go down, down? Okay, what if I ignore all of this? And I truly go down, down. Oh, I think I remember this area. I think there was not much that I was able to do in here. But then like I had to like go back and trigger some powers and learn some stuff and yeah I do remember getting stuck in the demo for this game but it's not gonna happen to us is it? Not again. Just because I don't remember things doesn't mean that it's gonna happen again. Save we'll take that. Right that's a new power that we're gonna be learning now. Silex my storm comrade what a Curious circumstances bring you to the Vena Cava. Goldrim, it's been a while. Glad that you're doing well. This is Laguna, my new trainee. I figured I'd bring him down here to say hi. Hi! Well met, John Laguna. I am Goldrim, strong defender of the Vena Cava. The path of Araska is very hard. Such monumental task is suited only for the most exemplary in Paragon of the Curative Engine screen, which is hard. Wow, you're almost as cool as Silex. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You seek to wield your venerable title of curative agent, John Laguna? What makes you believe that you can bear the burden of preventing our life, of preserving our life and our ask? But I want to help people. If I can, oh, and uh, I can control water a little bit, look. Ah, impressive little one. Your power is not dissimilar to my own. However, you release your control too early. It is a symptom of an untested will. With practice, you will find yourself capable of far greater feats. Once you can maintain and extend the control of your power, you will amplify your abilities by tenfold. You yeah, sure? Let me try. I suspect that you are in. It slipped, but I had it, did you see? I did not expect you to master that skill so readily. See that, Goldwyn? Goldrin. Better watch out, or Laguna is gonna be guarding the Vena Canva soon. Perhaps, but Laguna resolve remains untested. Train hard, young Laguna. When you have started down death itself and forced it to blink. Return to me then, and I will gladly welcome you as my brother in arms. Yeah, don't you dare test me! No! Be fair or fall my enter in that freaking place! Yeah, 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 yeah. take it easy. Man. Yeah. I'm yeah, just having a normal conversation, but that's fine. So we're learning a little bit, but that's that's kinda cool. It's like you charge it up. Sorry. You charge it up and then yeah, you can actually push it. I think you can even push it up, yeah. But hey, it doesn't matter. Just change it. It should break any time and you can actually use it to make double jump. Yeah. Don't really care about this. Let's check what's in here. But you guys see how big this whole area is. Yes, it's, it's insane. Oh, we can actually not go this way? Okay, yeah, but that power that we just got is what we needed to like be able to progress through the world. So we're fine. Uh, yeah, we're fine. Oh, I thought 
Right. Okay. Ah, oh, monsters just show up. Whatever. The damage that we do with our boy Silex is... Impo Ooh, so much damage. Thank you so much. Oh, the damage is good. Took some damage right there. Well, not, not so good, but something is better than nothing. Okay, then from here you gotta like jump. Yep. There you go. Taking a little bit of damage, but nothing too impressive. Or nothing too detrimental for our adventure. Okay, taking a look at our different powers. There's no way for me to go through the top if I am not... No, no, we can actually go through the top. That's what we gotta do. I think for a second I lost, like, power. Oh my god. Oh my god, did I lose power again? Am I losing... What I'm saying is because... I don't know why. It seems like... I might be experiencing some blackouts. I might be going crazy. Like, doesn't matter. Uh, I could go up or get kicked out. Let's get kicked out so we can check it. I believe Laguna can like... No, you cannot. Yeah. You can do that? Excuse me? I didn't know that those things are able to shoot at you. What does this do? Laguna's attack has increased. That's beautiful. You didn't know that those things can actually destroy us like that. Nasty. Look at that, so many secrets that you can get through right there. I could get shot in here, but unless we come from the other side, this doesn't really give us like any secrets, so it doesn't matter. Now, from here, we normally would like to go, I think, up. Yep, there it is. Oh, shit, the infection is going up. Everything is shaking. Silex, what's happening? Something's distressing our ask. Like, likely a parasite attack and a bad one. It might be wise to return to the headquarters. Christine should know where to go next. Before anything, let's go inside. Hey, buddy. I got some creatures, I think. Ah, last time you completed three. Since then, you haven't completed... Oh, okay, okay. So when they're talking about completing pages, this is one parasite that we completed. And then this is another one, this is another one, but we haven't completed the rest of them. So that's why the game is like, yeah, you, you are a rich. I get it, okay? I get it. All right, um... I can make this jump, two, three, four, let's go, and then from here, headquarters. Uh, shoot me. Hey there. Silex, that, thank God ass you're here. You feel that, right? Where's the parasite? I heard something huge flying around your Araska's necks. To the east, now! Laguna bot, are you ready for your first real fight? I promise I will not let you guys out. And that's pretty much where we're actually gonna be wrapping things up as soon as we defeat that thing. If, it's, if you take a look at the map, look at where the parasite is. This is where things that we didn't have the first time that we played. And we didn't have the opportunity to take a look at from here. We didn't check the bottom. Let me check it out. Ah, uh, I think I can actually get... Wait, how do you get there? Oh, probably a double jump that we don't have just yet. Oh, the wild jump. Anyways, it's over here, guys. Come here, baby. Nice. Do it again, baby. Come on. Yep, you're dead. Let's go. Wait, I thought we were gonna be able to like... How, how did I miss this? Oh, I'm trying to go from the top, but you actually have to go from the bot. That's my bad. That is my bad. Right, so you get in here. Wait for him to shoot. Make that disappear. We went through the bottom, but that is incorrect because now we have to go through the top. Uh, that's perfectly fine. All right, I can actually use my power right now to like kill these things and then we have this guy this is not good this is not good just gotta 
Gotta be a little bit smarter about killing enemies and doing a little bit better. Journal updated, that's good. Thank you. Wait a second. Let's go. I want that. Doesn't matter. Now, this is the tricky part of this whole adventure. I believe what you gotta do is you destroy this. You go here, charge it up. And I don't remember what is it that made me, like, make mistakes in here. I believe, like, you push it, then you push it up. Yeah. And I believe once it goes down, you do something like this. Ah, uh, let's go. Yeah, that section right there is tricky. Like, it took me forever to discover before I, I did such a bad job in there. Anyways, here goes nothing. Let's go, guys. We got business to tackle. Pipen, I do not know how did you escape, but you have plenty of time to tell me once I lock you back up. <laughs> I spent entire days in that cell wondering how your blood will taste and I cannot wait to find out. And it is so kind of you to bring me this fluffy little appetizer too. Here we go, baby. Nope. This battle is actually really hard. So if I remember correctly... Yep, you gotta like keep your eyes open. And keep moving. Never stop moving. Never stop moving against this guy. There you go. That's a move. Ah! That's fantastic damage that we're dealing with right there. Don't, don't, don't. Keep good distance. Keep good distance. No. Wow. No! Get away from me! Ah! What? Oh, I got saved by a second! That thing blows up and kills you like what was one hit? Oh my god, I'm about to die! The damage! What? Just finish him! No! What? That range in there is so big! Wait. Oh, I forgot to save. But that range was just nasty! Like, I, I, I am gonna be honest with you guys. I, I didn't know that it... I... I mean, that battle was on the back, and the game was like, yeah, no, how about you? How about you eat some of this? That was so nasty. Ah, oh, come on. Thank you for the save, and let's go. Let's get this moving. Let's take revenge, baby! Okay, come on, shoot at me. Nope. You're gonna come and come here. As long as I keep moving towards him, I should be fine. And then destroy him from behind. Nope, touch that. As you guys can see, you guys told me once once an enemy pisses me off. Like they, they just die. They just die once they piss me off. It's just like, die. Not again! That is pretty much my signature move. Destruction. <laughs> How are you feeling, Pipen? Going to cause more trouble for me? Nothing to say? Well, he's not going anywhere. Christine will send someone to pick him up. Check. And here's where the nasty part begins, I believe. Oh, a dead end, Silex. Um, I'm not sure we can get back home this way. Ha! Ah, a little while isn't gonna stop two curative agents on a mission. Watch this! Hey! Hey! Yay! Ha! Ah, there we go. 
Now that's what I call a wall jump. It's amazing. We'll be able to get anywhere now. But wait, why didn't you use this move before? Well, I've actually never been too good at it. I practiced for years and I was never able to do it consistently. So I guess I kind of gave up. But you've been pushing yourself so hard recently, picking up new talents left and right. It made me realize if you can learn things so quickly, then I really have no excuse. Now, let's see if I can land another one. Can I just do this? No. I was wondering if I could. Oh yeah, no, you, you, you're kind of like stuck. That's fine. This wild jump feels pretty decent. I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna be honest with you guys. So we came all the way here for what reason? Are we trying to like connect places? But wait! Get away from me! Get away from me! Wait, 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 wait a second. I still got things that I want to explore at the bottom. But this is just connecting, so... Oh, wait, 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 but did I just... Ah, shites! Uh, Clyde, are you hurt? Where did that parasite go? Silex, just in time. I thought that that monster was going to put me to bed for good. I'm not sure where it slithered off go. Good riddance, I say. Clyde, that thing was, uh, cone worm. We need to secure the area immediately. Really? I mean, it was gross, but it didn't look so dangerous. Sure, until it embeds itself in your spinal cord that makes and takes over your brain. Oh no. It did it already. A parasite can do that? Good thing that little freak skedaddled then. Nope, nope, nope. Silix! I don't see anywhere the cone world would have gone, Clyde. Are you sure you're alright? Silex, are you saying Clyde might have been? No, 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 no! Wait a minute, Tony! Clyde, I need you to hold still. We need to be absolutely sure. Oh yeah. Ah! Silex! No, no! Silex! Uh, are you okay? Say something, please! Uh! Silex! Champion of the curatives, hero above and below the shell! Those claws have torn apart hundreds of my parasites. At long last, you belong to me. I awaken your rage. I awaken your might. Now, prove you're worthy of the gift that I have given to you. Kill the boy. Send him somewhere from which he will never return. Ah. Silex, it's me! What are you? Uh. Oh, but I can survive this po- Oh wait, I cannot. I don't have a way to survive this. Yeah, I'm so dead. I'm very sorry, everyone. Oh, new power? Oh, I remember where I'm at. I know where I'm at. Silex. Okay, breathe, like Laguna, breathe. What would Silex say? He say, focus on what's right in front of you. You're still alive. Silex still alive, probably. You just need to get somewhere safe. Back to the headquarters, yes. If you can make it in, in there on your own. If you can do it. Oh, so you can actually bubble myself on the water. So, it's a little bit sad. I honestly... I, I thought for a second, like, I thought we were doing something different, but when we were battling that boss that we defeated, right, I wanted to go straight, but I thought, oh, maybe we do this and then we can actually trigger something and then we come back. But I guess it's a mistake. We still got to re-explore this area. Well, anyways, it, it was a pretty crazy turn of events. I'm pretty sure that you guys were not expecting a magical creature to show up like that. But anyways, this game has been pretty cool. We're definitely gonna keep going. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Let me know in the comment section down below what are your thoughts on the game. Let me know in the comment section down below. Also, I mean, if you guys think that my boy Laguna is a good boy. Anyways, I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Much love to y'all. Thank you so much once again for the, for the, for the actually review copy. It's actually amazing. Much love to y'all. And I'll see you guys in the next one.